Doing the job that we do, we get to work in the most incredible places. We're lucky that we often get to work together as brothers. I'll be providing a live drone shot for Adam's news feature, and Lenslifters brings FPV to the TV. Packed up, loaded, got all my kit on the way to the Lake District again. Second time in a week. Um, going up to shoot a piece for the BBC Breakfast um, to film a drone live. Uh, the piece is about um, the paths, how, how the National Trust maintain the paths going up, up and down the mountains of the Lake District. Adam, who is reporting for this piece, has asked if I could come up a bit early to get some FPV footage of the mountain path. Fueled up, ready to go. Two hour drive. So here we are, I'm going to head up the side of the mountain on the search for Ad. He's currently at the top of the mountain so I might, he might be coming down as I'm going up so wherever we meet we're just going to stop there, throw the FPV drone up and get going. Well here we are, we've arrived. For this one I'm packing light, I only need the FPV equipment, drone and GoPro. Ratchet, spare set of props just in case. My goggles, of course, they can just get in there. Controller, and oh, an SD card. Back, back on, get walking up the mountain. Do this as quickly as possible. Let's go. That is the highest mountain in. England. I think it's just below a thousand meters. Um, takes a good few hours to get up to the top, but hey. Adam has just texted me saying he's on the way down, he's about two thirds down, and then we'll get some FPV done. It hasn't even been a week since we last climbed the mountain up in Langdale. I'm done. Done of mountains. I'm heading off the beaten path because I found a nice advantage point just behind these rocks. Oh my word, there he is. There he is. I've That is Adam, 100%. There. There he is. I'm going to have to run to him because I've got less than a minute left on the SD card. There he is. Hello! Welcome to the vlog. <laughs> Say your piece. Just long enough to tell you that I'm absolutely knackered. Uh, I came down quite quickly. I've been jogging down in the style of like parkour. I've been hoping you know, that it was you on every person that comes past and it hasn't been. Let's do some FPV flying. I need to get some eye goggles, uh, sorry, some eye stickers for this. I need to uh, spec it up a little bit. Let's do this. With the FPV shots in the can, it was time to head back to the hotel so Adam could start editing the report and to get some all important rest ahead of a very early start. So the time is 4.30am, it's time to get up and head. 
head to location for BBC breakfast. The location's 45 minutes away, and then we've got to set up to go out live at start from six. Got another hour to light, haven't we? I suppose it'll be quite light at six. Yeah, it should be. It should be nice and sort of Perfect. golden, golden hour. and then we're going to beam the image up to the satellites and then back down to Manchester. That is us, we're ready, set up, plugged in. The first live is in five minutes time and we are just getting some live view of the beautiful scenery. Uh, Adam McLean is at Scarfell Pike in the Lake District to explain why it is so important. Adam, good morning to you. Good morning. It is an absolutely beautiful day uh, here in the Lake District. Take a look at this. This is our live drone shot from above where we are at Wasdale Head. Uh, we're in the shadow of Scarfell Pike and we're quite near to the path that takes you all the way to the top of the mountain. Sun's up and out now. Uh, time is... 20 to 9 and we are on in 10 minutes. Adam's piece included a bit of FPV flying from yesterday. How are you feeling, Ad? Ready to go? All good. All set. Oh, Stand by, Adam. Here we Come go. Have you. a good one, mate. See you up there. See you in, see you in 20. See you in a minute. Right, let's get started. Adam McLean is at Scarfield Park in the Lake District. Good morning. The paths uh, on these mountains take a huge amount of effort to maintain, to keep them uh, in a good condition. And we're going to hear about that uh, in just a moment. But it is a beautiful day uh, here in the Lake District. Take a look at this. This is a live shot uh, from our drone right above where we are at Wasdale Head. The sun has just risen over the top of Scarfell Pike and we're close to the start of a footpath that will take you right to the top. Now there are 400 miles of footpaths across the National Park. So that was a successful job for the BBC, providing some FPV footage. That's the first time F any of our FPV footage has been on the telly. Um, also providing the live drone footage via the Inspire 2 as well for Adam's piece. Um, but whilst I'm here in the Lake District, I've got to take advantage of these mountains and cliffs. The problem I found with flying FPV in a place like this, you can never have too many bad trees. I mean, the water for the lake is just crystal clear. You just want to stay here all day filming, flying, even going for a swim. I've chosen the spot to do some flying from. Um, got all the kits here, there's a little flat patch where I can take off and I can land on the grass patch up there. Here goes nothing. Abort, 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 there's too many people in the way. Obviously you need 50 metres separation uh, from other people and and there's some people in a boat down there that are just about 10 meters off of the shore give them five minutes to get out of the way what i usually like doing is swapping the sd card on the gopro just in case it does end up in the drink but i'm a good swimmer so i'd go in after it I give, all, I give all the rushes to Adam and then Adam ingests them and puts the SD cards into a secret cupboard at his house and never to be seen again. Oh look, he's telling all his mates now that there's a, that there's a drone and then they're going to come and attack me. Good luck keeping up with this drone, pal. A bit too fast for you, mate. Fred. Fred with the big head. Okay, our canoe is clear. Here it goes.
a wrap for today's video. Uh, I don't really want to leave because it's such a beautiful day, but since the call time this morning was a 4 a.m. rise, I think I best head back. But I'm definitely heading back up here, bring the fishing rods, bring a barbecue, kayak, family, and we'll have a day out here. Thanks for joining us. Hopefully we'll see you again on next week's video. Please like and subscribe, please comment, and uh, let us know what you'd like to see uh, in the next videos. Over and out.